Hello, and welcome to another perfect video. I couldn't think of anything else better to do this week for a video, and so I'm just gonna do quick breaks. Um, I'm gonna be testing vehicles, and just trying them out, seeing how they work and stuff. Most of these vehicles I'm gonna be doing I've already used before, just playing by myself, so... Or with my friends, but, um, yeah. Also, uh, if my um, voice sounds any better, that's because I'm not using the microphone I've been using, so yeah. Um, so first up, we have a Measure Sweat BF110. Uh, you might know about the Measure Sweat BF109. So the 109 is a German World War II fighter plane. The 110 is a German World War II bomber plane. So this thing is really fast. Um, it has at least in the game, for this one it has three bombs on each wing. Uh, I can't remember what its payload, normal payload was in real life. I don't, if I recall, I don't even know what it, what it was, but yeah, we're gonna be testing this out. Uh, I'm in the military, so I have rocket launcher to destroy this if. if so, go in here. This thing is really loud. Uh, so if you can't hear my voice over it, and then, yeah, you're just going to have to get one up by again. Um, hopefully you can hear this though. Okay, we're just gonna... What is the plane? Oh, it's all the way over there. I'm just gonna head back to the workbench. <laughs> um, so yeah, this again was called the... Uh, yeah, I have a lot of stuff. It's called the Meshlesmet BF-110. There's like a lot of things in the description here. If you hover over it. Uh, it's, yeah, yeah, it, as it says at the bottom there, it's, it was made by Sweet Fox. Um, so yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna use next. But I'll be back soon to use something. So, yeah, that'll be that. So, yeah, I <laughs> see you in a bit. All right. Well, we have another vehicle. So, if you if you watched my previous Brooklyn video from last week, um, you will probably recognize this car. This is the GMI. This is the Rally Runner GMI. It is a it's supposed to be like a rally racer thing. Um, it's <laughs> whenever I use it, unless I use my giant bomb I used last week, it's near indestructible. Like I mean, it was by indestructible I mean it loses pieces, but you can't completely destroy it. Like, unless you fire, like, ton, like, a ton of RPGs at it, or something like that. And, yeah, so, I'm just gonna drive this around. Um, uh, and maybe I'll get the tank to try and destroy it. I don't know, maybe. Like, the plane. Except for when it screeches like that, but it can be pretty annoying. So, yeah, it, like, took it just. Uh, and I didn't mention the tank earlier, so I, I have I've tanks to show you. There we go. Obviously, I didn't make I barely. I, I, I don't want to make it close to me. Unless it's a chicken. So, yeah. Anyway, um. I'm back here gonna try and drive away, and I'm gonna try and hit the railroad tracks and see if we explode. Or, if there's enough ground clearance to actually jump them, I have no idea. Yeah, if you have the parking brake on, it's really hard to tow your Oh, I over tow your truck. And also, you're gonna probably, whenever I use a car or possibly a tank, I'm definitely gonna hear they say Tokyo truck, so. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, 
Um, let's go. See what happens when I hit the other one tracks. Over 50. So, um, or whatever, 75. I don't think I'm gonna get to 100. No. <laughs> See what I mean by indestructible? This thing can still go. Like, it loses one tire in a couple of pieces when it hits the other tracks. At almost 100 miles per hour, and it's still can go. It's like it never happened. Shuffle. Yeah. This thing is interesting. Did I hit it? I. Yeah. Okay, I can hit it. Okay. Yeah, that hit it. <laughs> Come on. I think I stopped it moving. I want to get to end. Oh, it's still moving. Come on. See what I mean by this thing's indestructible? <laughs> it's not. Even like five RPGs can't, can't completely destroy it. I need to get the engine. There's the engine. Okay. I miss the engine. But this engine is also indestructible, apparently. Oh, there we go. Finally. Anyway, that's the end of that. Um, I'm gonna be getting a different creation. No. So yeah. Also, I'm leaving all the creations that I already used, so if we come up, uh, if we, like, come up to that plane I crashed earlier, or, um, the flaming car, <laughs> yeah, you'll know where they came from. So yeah. See you in a little, see you in a bit. A German tank from World War One. It is called the A seven V, I believe. I always thought it was the A Z seven. Yeah, I got the I got the A Z correct at least. Um uh anyway, yeah this thing is uh he's oh wait it's nice actually okay. Oh that's nice. That's actually nice. Okay, let's get back to the let's get back to the normal camera. Come on. Come on. What is how do I get Okay, I'm gonna get out of it and get back in. Yeah! How do I get <sighs> Okay, I'm gonna have to like respawn it. Um Yeah, I'm gonna respawn. So, let's try that again. Oh. Yeah, okay. Ace, okay, there we go. Oh. I have a few different versions of this, I'm, I guess I'll just use this one. So, as you can see, it is extremely Like, extremely strange. Um, and this one was not by the way, I've been history of um, he's gonna come by as soon as I drew the tank, and he's gonna come by as really, really jack buttons, and really, really bad speed. It's clearly a tank that I'm gonna so he's gonna be a German motor one, but not a, um, you know, that type. It is a, um, other type of coverage. The one that I have personally. And I'm back to my cousin. I don't even know. Anyway, this tank's boring, guys. See what I mean by heavily armored? I fired an RPG at point blank and it did nothing. Oh, well, that did something. Anyway, uh, I guess just. Oh, I'm. Did I actually hit it? I think I just hit it. <laughs> What the? Let's try it. Oh, that was a. Yeah, I overshot that. Anyway, I'm gonna get a new vehicle. Be back in a few seconds. Hello. Um, so this monstrosity is the Landwall Fortress. It is big. <laughs> and so, um,. That tank? Also, this thing is 
a couple more. Yeah, I don't want this video being too long. Alright. Here's another vehicle. This is a NASCAR. <laughs> um, also, yeah, so, um, I know I have, I know after the first uh, vehicle, the plane, I haven't been saying anyone else's usernames when I, when I haven't been comparing them. I will put all of these vehicles in the description of the video, eventually. <laughs> I may have time today when I upload this, which, by the way, the date when I'm uploading this is May 4th. Okay, fine, I gotta make up the stupid Star Wars joke. <laughs> I mean, it's Star Wars Day, okay? <laughs> um, and I gotta do a Star Wars creation, I guess. Um, so yeah. Um, I'm probably not gonna make a stupid Star Wars joke, but I'll get a Star Wars creation. So yeah. Alright, I think I already have one, but I don't even know how to use. Anyway, let's just test out this NASCAR. Um, so, I think it's meant for the racetracks, Alpha Giant, Flat, Map. But, I don't know, let's see. Well, it's Sacred Dark Future, which makes sense because it's a NASCAR. Plus, I didn't even know it Uh, I'm just going to be permanently Tokyo Drifting, I'm literally just holding down W and A and doing nothing else, and it's just choosing to just go this <laughs> Don't know, it's not going to be. It's still going in. No, uh, this thing takes a while to rest. Okay, this thing is, I mean, you don't have anyone to race with this thing. It's just ramming into the cars. One pi like two pieces came off. Come on. Okay, fine. Oh, I my RPG is not reloaded. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, so we got that. Let's get the engine. I I have not got the engine. Um, is the engine not even at the front? I don't think so. Okay, this card is like okay. I'm just gonna. <laughs> anyway. That's that, for that car. I'm just gonna have to destroy it. Okay, I'm gonna have to move on the next I'll move on to the next thing. Alright, we have yet another vehicle. Um, this is the 1969 Flying Camaro. Yeah. Um, it's a normal ground. But, uh, I just 
the end of that. There's another car. This is perhaps one of the largest creations in Brick Pigs, or at least one of the largest creations I have ever used. This is a battleship. And it's not just any battleship, this is the KMS Bismarck, a German battleship for Mobile 2. Uh, sunk, it sunk the HMS Hood, the uh, ship in the British Navy uh, at the time. And then it was sunk by like the German ships. Um, yeah. <laughs> so this thing is massive. And it actually has firing guns. The secondary guns do not fire. That's why you can aim the guns up and down. It, and you can actually turn them. So I'm trying to like try turn them all that way, I guess. Also, I love how there's smoke coming out of this box stack. That 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 makes it fun. Like, it makes it more really fun. It it was already fun. <laughs> also, the NASCAR. <laughs> oh, I just like destroyed that gun. Uh, I'm, eh, 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 pick up, the NASCAR's like, just, absolutely, mm -hmm. okay, mm -hmm. by the way, I can aim with guns, in the sink, there, okay, oh, oh, whole, oh, Great way to destroy it. Because an RPG clearly won't do anything. <laughs> so, here's a great way to destroy it. Oh, uh, yes, let's just use the map. Place it on the Oh, 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 ship's gone. <laughs> Bye. Anyway, um, that is the end of that. I'm going to be, um, I'm gonna be. The, the video is done now. Yep. Uh, yeah, yeah, um, definitely nothing else that's going to be in this video. Um, video's done. Bye! Alright. When I said bye previously, that was a joke. Yeah, I. I wasn't gonna forget that I said I was gonna spawn something from Star Wars. Uh, this is called Star Wars Dreadnought. Um, it's. It's supposed to be the Star Destroyer, I believe. Uh, it says firing guns. Uh, I think I can just. Oh, well, that's Amy. I let it. Let it. I can't. Flyable Star Destroyer. It's, I think, a more, um, a more realistic, um, uh, Star Destroyer model. This is an actual buy this time, and it's, and, yeah, no more creations after this. But yeah, uh, again, at some point, possibly today, possibly tomorrow, possibly a week from now, I will, by now I mean like when I'm uploading this video, like a week from when I uploaded the video, I will put the 
names of every creation I used and the links to the workshop pages. Um, once I eventually do that, make sure to go there, um, subscribe to them and everything, comment I guess if you want to, like if you want to, like on the um, uh, um, workshop pages. Um, um, but yeah, that's that. I guess I am going to be floating off into space here with an RPG. Oh, RPG launcher. I just launched an RPG. <laughs> um, but yeah, bye bye. See you for next video. And also, one final announcement I may or may not start putting out videos every Friday. So I might start doing two videos a week. I'm not sure. I will have to decide about that. But I am just telling you I may, so look out, possibly I'll put a, a video on Friday, possibly not. Bye-bye.